going on guys? Um, as you can tell by the helmet, I was just about to head home, but we just worked on uh, this skill and I wanna make sure that we feel comfortable with it. So I wanna put on video and you guys can um, use that as a resource anytime you want. Okay, um, we are gonna be solving proportions using algebraic steps and we have a portion right here um, that we've looked at before. Two smoothies uh, have five strawberries in it. So how many smoothies would have nine strawberries? Um, and so X is equal to a number of smoothies. Okay, and there are many ways for us to solve this proportion, but we want to focus on using algebraic steps. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is use in the inverse property. I want to multiply uh, this side by 9 over 1. Okay, and I know that what I do to one side, I have to do to the other side. So I'm going to multiply this side by 9 over 1 before I forget. Okay? Now, I, ha I do want to resolve this. I, I am trying for 1x, and I want to see if this helps us get there. Okay? This is going to be x times 9, and I see that as 9x. And this is going to be 9 times 1 in the denominator. That's going to be 9. And uh, what you see here is <clears throat> 9 times x over 9, which I think we could write the same as 9 over 9 times x, which is the same as 1x. So we did that over here. We multiplied by the inverse, the reciprocal, and we got 1x. And on this side, we want to resolve um, the, the fraction multiplication. 9 times 2, I have 18. 1 times 5, I have 5. 1x, the number of smoothies, is equal to 18 over 5. Now, 18 divided by 5, I'm going to do the, the division real quick. That's 3.6. So, 1x is also equal to 3.6. You can make about 3.6 smoothies using 9 strawberries. Alright, hopefully this helped, and uh, see you guys soon.